My name is Brian Velasquez. Today I will be explaining the process of the events MLB postseason or playoffs. Okay, first things first, we got to break down the basics of baseball. So they have 30 Major League Baseball teams, and those 30 teams are broken down into two different leagues. As you can see here, you got the American League and the National League. And each league has 15 teams. And since each league has 15 teams, you break down those 15 teams into three divisions, which you got the West, the Central, and the East. The East. Each division consisting of five teams for both leagues. It's the same thing. And now that we know the basics of which teams go where, we'll, I'll explain the process of who qualifies for the playoffs or the postseason. As you can see, this bracket here. This is what we'll explain. So you got five teams per league that make it to the to the playoffs. You got the American League on this side of the bracket, the National League on this side of the bracket. Uh, the first three teams that qualify, you see numbers here, you see one, two, three, and then four and five. One, two, and three are determined by the winner of each division for the best winning record. You got the West winner, Central, East, same thing for National League. Right here, the brackets are mirrored. So one, two, and three are obviously determined by the winners, and four and five are determined a little differently. Four and five is called the wild card winners. They're usually, they are the top two second best place teams of each league. So you got the top two second best place teams of the American League and the top two second best place teams of the National League. And four and five, that is, they make the wild card. Uh, the winner of that um, series is determined by a one game playoff. So pretty much a winner takes all in this four and five category. And after they win, they will advance to what's called the American League Division Series. And they will face the number one team of the American League. We don't have no people. And after the, this division series, this division series is determined. Uh, as you can see, it's on both sides still. The division series is determined the best. Whoever wins the best three out of five games. And now, whoever wins the best three out of five games, you got eight teams left. From the wild card, two teams are eliminated. So now eight teams are left. Once you are in the division series. After the division series, whoever wins the best three out of five. Four teams are eliminated, two from each league, and you got four, uh, four teams left, which each uh, each team advances to the championship series of each league. So on this side, you got the American League Championship Series. On this side, you got the National League Championship Series. Now, this series is almost the same, just a little bit different. This one was best three out of five, and the championship series is the best four out of seven. And whoever wins the best four out of seven advances to what? Every team and every team's goal is at the beginning of the year to the World Series. So you got... At the end of the year, you'll get the American League champion of uh, this side and the National League champion on this side, and they'll face off in what's called the World Series in baseball. And they will face off in the best four out of seven. Whoever wins the best four out of seven will take that trophy home. And that pretty much sums up the MLB postseason.